Right then, coming next week, I have got a big surprise. This big thank you to AMD. Honestly, my first ever GPU to review. It is the AMD Radeon ARX 6900 XT graphics card. I've got it in my test bench and it's coming next week. Hey guys, welcome back to my next video. This time it's the GK500 Gaming Mechanical Keyboard from AOC. And I've got full list of features to show you that I'm going to take you through the overall layout, the overall build quality, and show you some of the RGB effects you can use through their web, uh, their actual software, which is called G-Menu. And what we'll do now is we will get straight into that. So continue. Right then, so this is the GK500 Gaming Mechanical Keyboard from AOC. So it has got a removable wrist rest but obviously it's very flexible it is a full metal construction there's a tiny bit of flex and what we'll do now is have a look at the overall sound type so we'll as you can hear that by there so here we go let's write a few sentences uh let's go okay so So that's what the sound of the keyboard, very nice, the full backlit RGB control, which is done through the, the software itself. Now it is G-Menu, G-Menu is very easy to use. And uh, what I will do is I will click through here and you can actually select individual buttons to do for the RGB effect. Now sensitivity, you've got repeat delay, you've got repeat rate you've also got the polling rate which does go up to a thousand hertz you've got light fx which you can do a full customized one or you can do wavelength which is that look at that that is awesome just got a random color that is cool you've got breathing which does it very slow but you can actually stop you can make it faster then you've got react one down which you just Press the button and it reacts to a certain color. So you go, see, that is awesome. I really like that. Then you've got a ripple effect then, which will just go, see, just like that. You click a button and boom, does that. That's very, very cool. You've got radar then, which uh, is this. Just does a very awesome kind of effect. You've got fireworks. Now this one is rather cool. Watch. Boom. So it just does that. You've got blink, which will just, yeah, just blink. You've also got wave, which is the basic color wave. You can do it from light, uh, right to left. Then you've got a custom setup in which you can actually set up the individual keys to different colors. So see, Q is up there. Now we do E for green or Blue, sorry, I am colorblind, so I, I can't really tell. Blah, and you can do that then for pink. You can do that then for that color. So you can do a full customization of the keyboard itself. I obviously like the wave color. Of course, that's just me. So let's get into the, into the rest of the video. Okay then, well you've seen the, the video now, showing you all the RGB effects, the overall build quality, yes, the wrist support on it is rather flimsy. It is it is magnetic, so that's a good thing. The full build quality of the keyboard itself, full metal construction. It's got a little, tiny bit of flex, but overall it's a very good quality keyboard. Now the price is around the forty-five to fifty-five uh, fifty pound mark on Amazon, and of course this mechanical keyboard is their middle range to their keyboards now obviously you can take off the keys they are for it is fully mechanical it's got red switches on it and the cable on it is sleeved which is quite nice and overall the the build quality is fantastic for the price now of course they have got more mechanical keyboards they've got another one which is the the gkm uh, G key uh, J G uh, 
GT GK700. Now, as you can see here, it's a full UK layout. It's got the, the number pad and everything. The overall clicky sounds, as you showed in the uh, feature set part of the video, it is very, very nice quality. As you can see, it is got metal construction, but there on top. There's a tiny bit of flex, only a little bit, but overall the quality is fantastic. It's got, you know, obviously it's got height adjust and it's fully controlled with the AOC G menu software. Now, if you want to buy this, I'll make sure to put down the link in down in the description below. And as always, very good keyboard. If you're looking for a new gaming keyboard, then I suggest it's a very good uh, option. It obviously, when it comes to peripherals, it is subjective to whose budget, personal preference, of course. But personally, it's a very nice keyboard, and for the price, it isn't bad. It is around the forty-five to fifty-five uh, fifty pound mark, so it is up there, like the M, uh, the MSI GK, what is it, the GK fifty-one or something like that. It is. That's a fully mechanical keyboard, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like, and as always. Have a nice day. Goodbye.